<laughs> yeah, these uh, these images are really meant for contemplation, for for meditation. People have asked me how I make them, what is their subject, what are they pictures of, but I tell them no. These images are what they need them to be. If I told them my story, if I told them how they were made, then they would become my pictures instead of theirs. If you look at them carefully, you will find your own meaning with them. And that's why you, as the viewer, are the real creator of these images. The one thing I can say is that they are all of nature. And they tend to reveal that underlying symmetry which is in the universe and that can tell us so many things. And that's why I call this series Mandala Natura Collection. When I started to play around with these images, I wanted to do what I've been doing for hmm, well over 55 years now as photographer, and that was to tell a story. And those stories I have been working on were done in black and white and on film. And they usually had some social meaning, and often it was fairly dark. These are different. I realized that when I showed them to people I'm close to, the first attempts on doing them, and I, the feedback I received was that they mean different things. Same image can mean different things to different people. <clears throat> the same image could be uplifting to someone and quite disturbing to somebody else. And some of the feedback I had was, was really gratifying. Things like that, the image, meditating on an image, on a chosen image, helped to bring forward things which were hidden for a long time. They were ready to come out, but the image was a bit of a catalyst and helped to bring them out. The other feedback I had that the same image would change over time as the person looking at or using the image would find different meaning in it as that new meaning was needed. And this was this kind of a feedback when, feedback when I realized that I need to share these images with as many people as possible to people who want to use them. And that's why they are on this slideshow. There are 64 mandalas, and each one of them is on the screen for around 10 seconds. So if a mandala, if an image grabs your attention, stop the flow and really look at it. Let it soak into you. See what kind of an emotion it brings up. Listen to what it perhaps may be trying to tell you. You can use these images and it any way you wish. You can share them with other people. The only thing I ask is that you use them with good intentions. That you don't use them to persuade somebody about something. Use them for yourself and share them. And I also ask that you don't try to make money out of them. That would not be a good intention. The files in this slideshow are fairly small, big enough to enjoy them, but um, the originals are much larger. And I have printed them large. I have done one for my beautiful life partner. It's three by three foot image on canvas. And she has it in her meditation space and tells me that it has really been helpful to her. So if you would like to use one of these images in any other way or um, perhaps have it printed on, in a larger format, please get hold of me. 
Uh, my contacts are at the end of the slideshow. Thank you so much for looking at these images, and I hope they bring something to you that's useful. I'll let you look at the rest of them in silence. Thank you. <laughs>